Yo, what's going on guys? Bammy here. Welcome back to another video on my channel. We're actually doing the, you know, release date for the new kit map. It's Saturday, May 18th at 3 p.m. EST. Bambi.mindkated.com is the server IP. We have for the map information, 15 man's map, infinite rosters. There's new builds, uh, experience brand new builds around all the kit map. But yeah, they've worked, reworked the uh, slash fun armor set is two days. G kit is three days. Diablo armor set four, Inferno five, Warden five, V kit five, Wraith armor set six. Founder Mask 7, Founder Pet 8, Founder Shard 14 days. Uh, yeah. There's also a voting system now. So uh, it's a new voting system. It's just like Playtimes. However, it's based off of total votes given in a season. For example, reward number one is um, available right now on SOTW after four votes. So yeah, do slash vote and you guys get free loot. It's free loot, so do it. But yeah, Warp Vanilla has been created. This is a brand new access. Warp Vanilla gives players a unique competitive experience. In this Warp, players will be finding new Citadel, Conquest, Koth, DTC, and Hardpoint. There's Vanilla Enchants only, no armor sets allowed, only two pets allowed, no star items, no balloons, no regeneration, Speed 2 is the maximum, no Disguise Potion, no uh, external effects received, no access to personal vaults, or slash shop, or slash sell. No warping out, the only through is exit, so it's basically like a end exit, like an end uh, on ACF. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Also, prop 5 axes, prop 4, sharp 6 axes, sharp 5. There are new Citadel and Conquest. There's introducing squads events as well. Squad event has been introduced to Kitmap, introducing squad royale, squad FFA, squad classic FFA, squad Koth, and squad CTF. The new uh, squad capture the flag is uh, each team has a maximum size of 50. Once the event starts, each team will spawn in on one side of the map. The map is based off Call of Duty Black Ops 2 raid map. Each team has their own flag as they will, um, you know, capture it. You guys know what capture the flag is. It's, it's pretty self-explanatory. Also, arcade duels have been added to kit map. You guys can duel in other arcade worlds with arcade functional. Enchants, Rune of Relief, and Flourish have been introduced. Max level 10, not stackable. Leggings enchant. The armor set has been introduced. You deal an extra 20% more damage. Enjoy a 10% damage reduction. Reduce enchant uh, cooldowns by 50%. Reduce pet cooldowns by 50%. For the pets, they buff Lucky Charm Pet. Um, Lucky Charm Pet level 100 now resets all enchant cooldowns. Snowman Pet has been vaulted. For star items, the Blindfold now sees through Smoke Balloons and Mirage. Flame Cloak star item has been introduced. And for Founder items, you guys can toggle on and off pets um, on Founder's Pet. Warp Nether removed 100% pet uh, collar negation. The Dojo, they removed some hacker bots to help um, any issues caused by them. The arcade is now double-sided. Players can enjoy a battle of 1v1 or team fight. A brand new V-Kit has been released on the store featuring the brand new Lucky Armor set. A new Chronicles has been released. Balloons cooldowns can now see, uh, be seen on the action bar and combat tag. And all bugs have been fixed. If you guys have any experience with a bug, please report it. But yeah, that's pretty much the kit map. I know it's pretty short, but it, um, you know, hope, hopefully you guys you know listen to all that. But yeah. Uh, I will guys I will see you guys in the next one but that is the kit map release see you guys there